everyone to defend this area. So we should focus on the officers near here first. Try not to push yourself too hard, Cao Cao. So, see, Retreat and request reinforcements. Impressive, cousin. You truly are the one that will conquer this land. From fulfilling my ambition. You are amazing, Uncle. been surrounded by the enemy just when I need to deliver this information to Master Guo Jia too. Truly great fighting, my lord. I can only dream of obtaining such results. Let the enemy scouts escape! What if word of our plans gets out? I didn't think I was going to make it out of there. So now I can deliver this message to Master Guo Jia. I ambition! Incredible! It's easy to see why you're the one in charge. What am I to do? Excuse me! How about that? Succeed. Why did I agree to this again? I've done as Master Josh you asked. Time to return. We've yeah. taken down a major enemy. Now they should be focused on us. Lend me a hand. I'm in your debt. We shall defeat. 
position. Do not allow a single enemy through. Lord Gia Shu, let us fight! We're not leaving our allies in danger. We'll go out and defeat Zhao Zhao's forces. So. We have successfully lured the enemy. Now, hold the line until we get the order. So. Nothing can stop me from fulfilling my ambition! You are amazing, Uncle! Is a crime deserving of the harshest punishment. I shall carry it out myself. You're asking me why I'm doing this? These people are thieves and need to accept responsibility for their actions. Those who disturb the order and discipline of our ranks must be punished. The fact that we are on the battlefield changes nothing. Yeah. Yeah. The necessary punishments have been meted out. Now we can resume our advance and attempt to make up for lost time. It wasn't a betrayal? <laughs> Still, that was pretty frightening for me. forces must have sniffed us out. Men, we have to keep the fire attack unit safe. Here. The yeah. enemy strategist must be as cunning as Master Joshu. <laughs> you yeah. are amazing, Uncle. So Impressive, 
cousin. You truly are the one that will conquer this land. What? I'm done for! Without us, there will be no fire attack! Stop me from fulfilling my ambition! Truly great fighting, my lord. I can only dream of obtaining such results. everyone to defend this area I never thought they'd attack our base here South Cell intends to cut off supplies to master Zhang Jiu I see if these supplies are lost one <laughs> castle will not last we must repel the enemy <laughs> area. Yeah. <laughs> 
Master Liu Biao. I'm so sorry. Yeah, nothing can stop me from fulfilling my ambition. Yeah. Report! Cao Cao's forces have raided and pillaged one of Liu Biao's bases. Our yeah. supply lines have been cut off? <gasps> then... This will be a hard battle.
Master Joshu's plan. No! Defend that fire attack unit! My lord, you are the true warrior of the three kings. So, surrender or die! See! Incredible! It's easy to see why you're the one in charge. We couldn't defend them. Now Master Joshu's plan is finished. Nothing can stop me from fulfilling my ambition. Everybody, prepare to storm the castle. I am interested to see what this master strategist actually looks like. Yeah. Fighting at one castle. Lord Sozo. Circumstances. Knowing Dian Wei, I should not have expected anything less. the heavens to face me in battle. So As I planned, I must come back. Truly great fighting, my lord. I can only dream of yeah. obtaining such results. Impressive. 
impressive, cousin. You truly are the one yeah. that will conquer this land. <laughs> Report from Lord Hu Chie. Enemies are attacking. Cao Cao has also been seen. Yay! <laughs> it's just as I planned. Okay, send the signal to the fire attack unit. It seems I have been thoroughly beaten. And surrender is my best option. For me! Oh, I failed to defeat Cao Cao! The sheer shame of it! it looks like we've taken care of the bulk of the enemy forces. Now it's time for me to really make my presence felt. You sure know how to fight. Nothing can stop me from fulfilling my ambition! Incredible! It's easy to see why you're the one in charge. You are amazing, Uncle. Afford to lose this position. I shall personally see to its defense. South South forces have made it all the way here. Incredible. They're that strong. Everyone, stand your ground. We will use the power of our cavalry to bury South South forces for good. I'm not finished yet. I'll use every last bit of strength I have to protect my lord! This is the end for me. Joshua. My lord is really quite something. I'm glad I was able to serve him. Master Cao Cao accepted Zhang Xiu's surrender. Your safety was assured. So why did you try and assassinate our lord? It is the tendency of the victor to rest on his laurels after a battle is won. I simply saw an opening for our side and exploited it. Cao Cao is nervous in regards to his upcoming showdown with Yuan Shao, no? As such, he immediately accepted our surrender, surprisingly so, in fact. I never thought that I'd be able to take advantage of the situation to overcome such insurmountable odds. Of course, it mattered not in the end. Yes. It was only thanks to the efforts of Master Dion Wei that Master Cao Cao was able to escape. However, things could have easily gone quite differently. Where's Dion Wei? He is at peace now. Master Cao Cao, I will resist you no longer. You have bested us. I am ready to meet my fate, whatever you may deem it to be. In that case, Jiashu, I want you to join me. W wait a minute, my lord. You're planning to let him live? Even after all he's done? If anybody should be punished, it should be me for falling victim to this trap and losing Dion Wei. Jiashu's talent as a strategist, the skill of Zheng Zhou's men to execute the plot, in my opinion, that is something to be rewarded, not punished. Joshua, 
Is it possible that you foresaw this very outcome? <laughs> I wonder. At any rate, I appreciate your rather generous punishment, Master Cao Cao. Guojia, I want you and Shun Yo to keep an eye on Jia Xu, at least for a while. I may covet his talent, but that does not mean we can trust him yet. I must do all that I can to quickly subdue the Central Plains and prepare for Yuan Shao's move south. Our next step is to advance on Shu Province and capture Xia Pi. That means we must face Lu Bu himself. Everyone, begin making the necessary preparations. Uh, I'm sorry, Tian Wei. If only I'd been there, we could have prevented all this. Xu Zhu, you can't blame yourself for this. You simply followed your orders out there. No, the responsibility for this falls squarely on my shoulders. Do you suppose Dian Wei would approve of me turning Jia Xu to our side? Lord Cao Cao. Dian Wei was not the type to hold a grudge. Cao Cao, I imagine you know that better than anybody. Yeah, he's right. I'm sure he's smiling to think it's just the type of move you'd make. Although, I imagine he must be a bit lonely right now. My lord, what do you say we raise a toast in his honor? Indeed. Tonight, let us celebrate Dian Wei's life as we mourn his death. Master Cao Cao, you must excuse this sudden visit. My sworn brother, Lu Bei, is in Xiao Pei, which has come under siege from Lu Bu's forces. I wish to request that you loan me some of your troops to repel Lu Bu. Hmm. So Lu Bu's finally making his move. He'd be better off staying in Xia Pi. There is merit in us eliminating Lu Bu from the equation. However, if we move now, Liu Biao may strike us from behind. Shunyo, tell me what you think. Lu Bu is currently the only active threat to us. Plus, there are no other forces that will go to his aid. We should take out Lu Bu before we face Yuan Shao. However, a siege will take time. If somebody else uses that opportunity to make their move, we'll be in trouble. In that case, how about this strategy? We dam the Ishui and Sushui rivers that run near Shapi, inundating the castle with water. That is a brilliant idea. We will channel the water into the castle at Shapi. We simply need to seize control of the floodgates to make it happen. Very well. We shall proceed with your plan. Begin making preparations for the flood attack. This is our best chance to slay the demon Lu Bu. I must return to Xiao Pei with all haste. Excuse me! It must have been difficult for him to break through Lu Bu's siege, let alone make it all the way here. Yet now, he looks to do it all over again for his master's sake. He uses his considerable might to fight for what he believes to be just. He is truly worthy of the moniker God of War. Huh. It was his actions that led to Lu Bu's rise in the first place. That's rather bitter of you, Shahudun. 
Although I feel I could utilize him properly if he were under my employ. Don't you agree? You're still hanging on to that dream? He will never leave Liu Bei's side. You heard him yourself. No. I suppose not. However, it is clear that the lowly Liu Bei does not deserve a warrior such as Guan Yu. The best way to bring down Sha Pi Castle is with a flood attack. I am confident that Master Guo Jia and I will be successful. A flood attack? Guo Jia and Shun Yo are brilliant indeed. Everyone, this is our chance to rid ourselves of Lu Bu for good.